Chris Owen Forum. We're taking you to Edinburgh, where students with UTRGV came together to lead a peaceful pro-Palestinian protest. Our Jeremiah Marshall was there and reports on how the protest also came with some pushback. A lot of people talk about a conflict, a lot of people talk about complicated, but it's really not that complicated. Several signs and chants. Israel, you can hide, we charge you in genocide. We're seen and heard throughout the UTRGV campus. I would like to call the people for them to inform themselves themselves because even if they think this might this doesn't involve them it really does and it's an important matter with the ongoing activity violence at the gaza strip several students say they wanted to raise awareness and educate their peers we want to speak out to help with humanity as this is a humanitarian cause it doesn't matter where you're from people are being killed and it's what's happening is wrong and we want to speak up and do the right thing Zena Kabash says this gathering means so much to her because her family is from Palestine and she has family in the West Bank. I think the most important thing is spreading information and awareness on this issue as it might feel like we're kind of helpless because we're so far away, but speaking out about it is one of the things we can do as um, we can't directly be there, but educating and informing about what's happening, it's really important for the cause. However, some students... Sat on the other side of the aisle. Uh, I'm here to show solidarity with Israel, uh, to uphold their right to self-defense. UTRGV grad student Jonathan Salinas says this group is in support of a different principle. They are not the friends of Palestine, they're the enemies of Palestine. Hamas, excuse me, the Palestinians have no greater enemy than Hamas, which is who they support. This is finals week, meaning this is one of the busiest times for students, but students say they are glad that their voices are heard. Working for you in Edinburgh, I'm Jeremiah Marshall.